قد جمعوا لكم فاخشوهم فزادهم ايمانا وقالوا حسبنا الله ونعم العمل Hello I have good news for you The US presidential election is almost over Another piece of good news that you're going to be reading about uh, uh, online and in the newspaper in coming days and weeks and maybe longer is the coming end of ISIS. That is the end of the fighters who have been occupying territory in Iraq and Syria. Right now the focus is on retaking the strategically important Iraqi city of Mosul. There are uh, Iraqi troops, Shia militia groups, Kurdish Peshmerga fighters and others that are advancing on Mosul at the moment. Um, they will liberate that city from ISIS and in the not too distant future ISIS will cease to exist as a fighting force in Iraq and Syria. May take months, it could conceivably take longer. It's only a matter of time. Now for the bad news. First of all, there are a lot of innocent people that are caught in the line of fire. In Mosul alone, there are literally hundreds of thousands of civilians trapped inside the city. And if the, the remaining few thousand ISIS fighters decide to fight all the way to the death, which they may very well, unfortunately, a lot of those people are, are liable to be killed in the fighting. The second piece of bad news is that once ISIS is defeated on the ground, some of those fighters will return to their home countries. In Europe, Russia has a lot of these fighters. In Southeast Asia and countries like Indonesia and Malaysia, etc. And yes, the U.S. also faces some risk, although that risk is less than it is in the places that I've already mentioned. The third source of bad news is that even after ISIS is defeated on the ground in Iraq and Syria, like Al-Qaeda after 9-11, it's simply going to change form and it's going to become no longer ISIS the fighting force necessarily, but ISIS the brand that lives on in cyberspace and in social media with its ability to inspire people to carry out more attacks. ISIS the brand will be with us much longer than ISIS the fighting force. It's something to keep in mind as you hear the good news of the advance on Mosul in coming days and weeks.